So hi everyone, welcome back to data science in your pocket and we have a big release in the audio space that is Maya 1 and it's one of its kind TTS model that also provides you with voice design technique that means you can also design the voice you want a female voice it should be shrill it should be loud whatever you just need to give a prompt and you can design that too that's quite interesting let's before jumping on to the details of the model let's hear a few examples so this is the voice description female in her 30s with an american accent and is an event host energetic clear dictation wow this place looks even better than i imagined so this was a text and this is the audio output generated by maya one wow this place looks even better than i imagined how did they set all this up so perfectly the lights the music Everything feels magical. I can't stop smiling right now. It's quite interesting. As you can see, it is able to take up the voice description quite correctly. Dark villain with anger. Dark villain character, male voice in their 40s with a British accent, low pitch, gravely timber. Welcome back to another episode of a podcast. Laughs. Harder. Today we are diving into an absolute fascinating topic. So one thing that you have noticed is a tags also that you can provide that gives you the expression so let's hear this out welcome back to another episode of our podcast <laughs> today we are diving into an absolutely fascinating topic very good i would say one of its one of the most unique models that has been released in the audio ai space Demon character, screaming emotion. Male voice in the 30s with Middle Eastern accent. You dare challenge me, mortal snot. How amusing. You dare challenge me, mortal. How amusing. Very interesting. It is able to take up expressions like snorting also. So that's great. Mythical goddess with crying emotion. After all we went through, to pull him out of that mess. It is able to take that female voice, mythical godlike, magical character. So, as you can see, the model is looking great in terms of TTS and the voice description add on is just amazing. Even the tag system is looking quite good. They've also provided a playground and the model is open source. So, this is the playground where you can try out the model right now. They have given two audios for you. Ava and Noah, you can shuffle, try these emotions. Let's try this out once. Welcome to Maya Research Studio. <laughs> Experience the future of voice technology with emotional intelligence and voice design. Very interesting. So you can try out the model here with your custom prompts. And now let's talk about the details of the model Maya 1, which is built, which is a 3 billion model with uh, Llama backbone. AI voice design TTS. What makes Maya 1 different? Traditional TTS is emotionally flat. It Whatever text you give it, it just gives you out in terms of audio. Maya 1 is emotionally rich. Create voices from description. That's the best part. And no pre-trained voice library is there. Core idea, text, emotion, sound. Text is natural language description. Emotions is voice characteristics and feelings that you can add. And finally, sound, custom voice design on the fly. Architecture is a 3 million parameter llama for sound. Decode only transformer is used. Snack, neural codec, and real time processing is there. So on a single GPU, it is give, able to give you 100 millisecond latency. That's quite good. Inline emotion control, you can use tags like laugh, sigh, whisper, as you can see. And this is the example I can't believe. Then laugh finally worked. This is very interesting. Training and data pipeline, I think pre-training, it is done on internet scale English speech corpus. Focus on acoustic coverage and teaches natural speech flow. And then fine tuning is also done on curated studio grade recordings. Human verified descriptions are given. Emotion tags and accent variation. And rigorous pre-processing pipeline is there. Why the XML trick work? The description part provides stable structure cues. Language models already understand the syntax. That's very important and short, clear, robust formatting. 
streaming that actually works 100 millisecond generally low latency streaming i think that's the best part you can stream the output that is coming out real time processing as mentioned snack codec and vlm integration is also there for local hosting open source i think it is uh, released under apache 2.0 license so you can use it in production without any restrictions modify the code to fit in your needs and sell products built on M maya m1 you don't need to pay anything to the company real world use cases we all know game characteristics voice assistant podcast audiobooks and whatnot you can have millions of use cases where you can design the audio too right so with this it's a wrap the model looks interesting i think giving it the voice design feature i think it it's quite unique also and it's trending on hugging face right now if you drop down a bit on the hugging face page as you can see they have also given you the same code how to run the model is quite easy using auto model for causal lm you just need to load the model and you can get started running it it's quite interesting and you should be able to run the model quite easily. I think 3 billion parameters you should be able to run in Google Colab. So with this, it's a wrap. I hope you try out Maya 1. It's very interesting. Thank you so much.